freaks. It's been a little while since I made a lawn care video. So I'm gonna go ahead and just bust this out now and answer a few questions that are very common, believe it or not. These come in various forms to me um, through email, whatever. It's a 2006 Chevy Silverado. It is just a rear wheel drive. It's not four by four. And I just cruise around town with it. This is my trailer. Yes, the basket came with it. And um, trimmer racks, more on that in a future video here soon. These are just something that came with it, and I'm just dealing with them because what have you. You know, that's what came with it. I just make do with what I got. All right, the trailer itself, 6.5, 6 feet 5 inches from wall to wall. So that's how much room you'll have in there. 12 foot long. And this mower is the Troy built TB230. It's the front wheel drive. And I use the front wheel drive because that's the first self propelled mower I ever had. So I'm used to the way it handles. I tilt up the back end and spin around, pivot around, drop it, keep it spinning the whole time, and just take off again. They're great for just flat land little areas like my yard and stuff right along in here, right? Not a problem. But if you have hills and stuff, you'll want rear wheel drive. So keep that in mind. All right, Snapper Pro, 36 inch. The deck cover's off because I never put it back on in time before I lost one of the little attachments. So <laughs> I'll have to get one to put it on. It's not even worth it for me, I just leave it off. So how many hours are on it? 596. Point nine. Okay, so 597 hours, and the shoot blockers, you can get them by trimmer trap. You can order them into your um, local dealers. Doesn't matter what brand your dealer carries, you can order trimmer trap shoot blockers. And they attach, they have various little connections and stuff, and this is just kind of like, um, like a mud flap type stuff material. And you just kind of bolt it all on and just kind of do your thing. So I love it, couldn't live without it. The days that it's broke down, which you've seen in some videos, then I have some big backyards that I have to push mow because the 48 won't fit in there. So, what's the story with the 48? I love it too. Actually, I really, really love it. I super love it. I could kiss it. You dare me to kiss it? Come here, baby, I'll give you a kiss. Let me give you a kiss. Don't you dare break down on me. Time saver. So I've got 82 hours on here, almost 83 hours. Every hour that is on the Ferris would have been put on there. And so every piece of ground that it covered in 82 hours it covered more ground than that would have in 82 hours. So it actually, those 82 would be like 100 over here or something. It, well, maybe not that much, but I don't know, maybe. Time saver, wider cut, faster. Love it. Again, shoot blocker, see how it has to stick out farther so you got more of this rubber stuff. Trimmer trap, you just leave it up. Fire away. No problems with it at all so far. Knock on some wood. Dunk, dunk, dunk. Another question someone asked, and this is kind of a good one. I'll get this measuring tape out here. All right, it's a legit measuring tape. Nothing. Whoa, almost sliced myself up. I'm out of practice. I'm making videos, freak. I've been on Instagram. Check me out geek to freak fit geek and then number two freak fit okay how tall are these suckers because a lot of people are tall like me and that does make a difference so the the grip is at 39 inches but if you go over here with these grips which are way more comfortable to me you're at about 41 inches at the bottom part where your hand would be now Keep in mind then, if you're gonna be standing on a Velky, you are going to add at least three inches to your 
standing platform. So you don't want to be, you know, hunched over and stuff. And I, I did have a Skag back in the day, so I don't know the new designs. It was like a 90s, early 90s model, and it was a belt drive. And I felt like I was too tall for it. I was hunched over and stuff. So, all right, next question. How do you like your new truck? Oh, I love my new truck. Love it so much. I drive it all the time. Well, I only drove it. I haven't even drove it 6,000 miles yet. Getting close. So there you go. There's how many miles I have on the truck. 5,900. Because I'm in that all the time. Driving around town, cutting grass. I come home. Maybe we'll leave, go get something to eat. Maybe we won't. There you go. <laughs> I've worked the summer away. So wait, where, let's see. Break that down. 6,000 miles, I think I'm paid, I think I've paid about, yeah, what month is this? Ninth month? I think I paid about a dollar a mile. There you go, that's really economical. It's a dollar a mile. You drive 100 miles, here comes a toll booth, you just stick $100 in it and drive another 100 miles. Stick another $100 in it. That's what I've paid so far. <laughs> so next, Oh, no, 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 let's back up here. Why don't I use this? It's kind of dirty, but this nice, shiny, clean truck, nice, clean inside, to cut grass in instead of that. Why are you even asking that question? Do I want to sit on these seats all dirty, stinky, slimy? Come on now. Do I want to be flinging rocks and crap at my nice truck? I'm already mad I dented it with the trash can. Yes, the dent is still there. I don't I don't do anything but survive right now still there I got a new trash can they gave me a new one it's a recycler I'm gonna fill that sucker up okay hedge trimmer I think it's a HS 45 it's the it's a steel two-foot blade 24 inch blade BG 55 hand blower I use 0.09 ugly line string trimmer you can get it at Lowe's other places it's the same stuff it's made by Shakespeare um, it's the triangle stuff that's what I use use whatever you feel comfortable with see how it's triangle it looks like it's glowing radioactive cuts through the grass no problem this is a steel FS 70R this one is the Johnny Mo Special. It's the one he gave me. The other one um, had some problems. This one I haven't used in a while, but I think it will start. But when that one gave me a fit, I, sw boom, I swung up here at the house, ran up, grabbed the Johnny Mo Special. And I, oh wait, it doesn't have a guard on it. So I hurried up and took the guard off of that one and put it on. There, because I guess Johnny doesn't like the guard. Now, why do I always grab that and not the Red Max, which is a Red Max right there, whatever that number is. That's what it is. <laughs> why don't I grab it? Right? Because this is my trimmer. I've used this style so much that I can't help. All right, we're about to be interrupted here. Someone's pulling up to pay me money. That's one of my grass customers. Shh. Hey. You're trying to catch us. Oh, that's cool. <laughs> All right, thank you. You're welcome. Some money. <gasps> All right, back to what I was saying. What was I saying? Oh, I was saying. This is my game trimmer. It's like your game glove. If you're playing baseball, it's broken in. You're not gonna go try and catch a, a fly ball with a stiff glove, right? You have it broken in. Hockey skates, you gotta have them broken in. You don't jump out there with something you're not used to. I grab it and I go, all right? I can, I can freaking trim one-handed upside down and sideways with this thing. Been using them for like six years. I've had nothing but these steel FS70, so I know what I'm getting when I pick one up. But the other big reason why I didn't like the Red Max. 
right down there that guard this guard will allow you to fling rocks against your shins vehicles windows you're gonna bust some crap out you gotta put your eye out <laughs> that guard is not right this guard you guys like how come you don't wear safety glasses or how come you don't hit stuff with that rocks hit me in the shin because of this guard right here okay the way it does this man it's perfect for me the way I try all right I'm going along here I know where it's going I know where it's going I never get hit it's that guard that one right here stuff's flying all over the place so that's why I don't do that hmm what else what else? It's getting kind of dark in here. Maybe you can see some stuff, maybe you can't. I got a little bit of light in here. Don't be scared. I got another BG-55, um, sort of. <laughs> I have to put some new string in it. Snapperoni. Grab the other one and go. And then I have what? Oh, there's there's my deck cover, but I don't. I only roll the little. Uh, yeah, whatever. I don't even know where they're all at. I got an extra Vilky tire here in case anybody snaps theirs up. But look at this. I got some trimmer racks here. Yeah. I wonder where I got those from. I'll tell you where I got those from. One of you cool freaks. Uh oh, we're about to be. Invaded by little toy freaks. What are you doing? I'm gonna see if my friends are out. You're gonna see if your friends are out? Mm -hmm. Alright. Come on out so you don't bark all over the place. Alright. <laughs> so, yeah, I really am living this lifestyle, freaks. This is a lawn care lifestyle right here. You don't do too much other than cut grass, get your kids, try to eat, keep this house from falling down all around you. Got washers, dryer, I can wash and dry it and crap all over the place. That is a BR400 old school squared up. Still works. I'll break it out in the winter time only. I got a little chainsaw up there. I got miscellaneous crippola. Who knows what I got? But that's the story. Answered a lot of common questions. Everything's cool. I've been making too many videos. Um, you know, school's back in, and I have to um, get used to this new schedule. So, I will make some more um, lawn care stuff and a lot more of my other freaky videos in the future. Until then, do what you gotta do, make some money, make some positive changes in your life, right? Keep that mindset, look at things in the correct perspective. See that smile right there? That's what you need to have on your face. Yeah, you freaks in there need to have smiles on your face. And think about good things, happy thoughts. Live in your happy bubble world. And until then, keep it freaky.